Can you make a computer virus in the Unity game engine? The game engine behind most of the games you play. No. I'm just kidding, of course you can, and today we're gonna make that a reality, so let's get started. Now, our very best bet at making something that can deal some serious damage to someone's computer is by using code. Now, Unity uses c -sharp, so it looks like this might get a little tricky. Extremely tricky, actually, but I have something up my sleeve. So I started off by making a script named virus and a dashing little sphere to attach it to. Now, let's make some malware. The first thing we want to make sure is that the user has no idea that our program is running on their computer. So I found this tutorial by CodeMonkey on how to make our Unity game transparent and run in the background. And aside from this absolutely bombastic Unity logo when you first launch the game, our victim would have no clue that anything was happening. Now this is very cool, but we need an actual payload to do some damage. And lucky for you, I have a really, really deadly trick up my sleeve. See, there's this really useful class in c -sharp called System. And it's usually used for pretty harmless stuff, like creating folders or files for stuff like save data, opening links, and changing the wallpaper. <laughs> I don't know why that's there. Now, Banana Dove, how are you gonna make a virus out of this? See, what if we paired all this with one function that pretty much every single Unity developer uses in their games? The update method. See, what this does is it runs anything you push in it over and over, basically every frame. The beauty of this is that no matter if you have a crazy NASA supercomputer or a Dell from 10 years ago, Windows will just keep allocating our game all the resources it needs. If you have more FPS, you create more files faster, and this works too well until Windows eventually crashes. Except it's pretty harmless. I mean, if you just restart your PC, it kills the app, and you can just delete all these files by hand, but this is definitely a virus in Unity. Pretty awesome. That's all. Thanks. Bye.